Hello, this is Mr. Heron, your math instructor. I wanted to show you about, really quick video here, just to show you um, how you can review your old exams. Here, let me, uh, let me get there. Okay. Um, all right, so, well, here, I'll, I'll let you see me in the corner, I guess. Um, where Where am I? There we go. So let me, so here's, here's our course. And um, so when you come into your course, if you want to click over on assignments, and then you'll see, okay, upcoming assignments. So here's the upcoming retake exam. So if you wanted to do a retake, and see the way it has the rocket off to the left. So remember, we always click on the ones with the rockets because those ones will use the webcam. So you can click on retake exam, you know, right there. Now, if you roll, this is this is under upcoming assignments. I'm clicked over here on assignments. Notice on the left, I've clicked on assignments. This is upcoming assignments. If you roll down, all these are upcoming. This is the future homeworks and exams and things. And here's undated assignments. You don't, you don't want to click on those. Um, there, you see, it doesn't have a rocket, okay? So, um, but if you go down here, past assignments, there's exam number three, part one. Um, exam number three, part one, exam number three, part two. So that's how you could look over your old exams. I hope I'm being clear here. So up here in the top, when you clicked on assignments on the left, upcoming assignments, if you wanna retake an exam, click on one of the rockets. That's for retaking an exam. But if you just want to look back at your old exam, probably before you do the retake, you want to look back at your old exam and see which ones you got right and wrong to help you study for the retake, right? So then if you so I so I've made that available now. So roll down here. So it's not in the upcoming exams, right? So it's and it's not in the undated. Don't go there. Go to the past assignments. And here it is under past assignments. Here's exam number one, number three, part one, exam number three, part two. So if I click on that, let me show you. Uh, I'll do here, I'll do number two. Click on that. It'll open up. And then it now it's not going to let you take it or anything, but it says view scored assessment. Or you click over here, review work and graphic, either one. Click on either one, boom. There it is. It's going to show me the um the old the questions. Here's I um here's like the answer I gave the little key shows the right answer here's an answer I gave I was just fooling around and it says no here's the real answer so you can go back over your old exam let me let me show that again so let me go back to assignments again I clicked on the non rocket to review so here we go so if you want to if you upcoming assignments if you want to retake an exam or take any exam at any time you click on the rocket right we take our exams with the rockets because that that does the webcam but if you want to look back over an old exam then roll roll down to past assignments and don't click on the rocket one i mean you can click if you want it won't let you do anything see it says closed so if i click on that it's just it's not going to let me do anything instead of because it's not going to let you take it again but instead of clicking on the rockets click on these ones that are not the rockets and it'll let you review your answers. It'll show you your answers. It'll show you the right answers for the questions. So that'll that'll help. Is that making sense? So to take an exam, any exam, upcoming assignments, click on the rockets. That'll use the webcam. To review an old exam after you've taken it, go down to past assignments and um click on click on the non-rocket or at any time, even even like right after you take it, if it's not even past due, it's on the same day, you'll find it up here under upcoming. You can click on the one that's not the rocket. If you click on the one that's not the rocket, it will allow you to review it. You just got to click on that. Now, don't click on the rocket ones to take the exam. Click on the non-rockets to review the exam. Now, having said that, don't think that you can just like, if I could just say, oh, I'll go back in here, I'll review it, you know, click on that, view it and just go, okay, which ones? Let me see, I missed this one. I answered EE, -E. it's probably not EE. -E. It should have been zero and pi. And then so I'll just practice this. Well, remember, it's gonna randomize the questions for every student, for every exam, the retake, it'll, it'll be just randomly, it, it's choosing basically from all your homework problems. So it's not, you're not gonna get the exact same questions on the retake. Well, then how should you study for the retake? You should go back to the practice exams. That's that's what has everything on them. So if you can do everything on the practice exams, you should be good for the exam or the retake exam or whatever. So if you're wanting to get ready 
for the for a retake exam. Before you click on the rocket, again, roll down to past assignments, click on the ones that are not the rockets, and th that will allow you to go over your original exam, show you your answers and the right answers, but then that's it's going to randomly pick different questions on your retake. So the best thing is go down to practice exam number three, for example, part one, if you need to do that, click on it. And even though it's late, it says, okay, it's late. Da, 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 you can just click on either redeem late pass or practice. Now, how do you know which one? Well, if you've already got a hundred percent on it, you know, all the points, then you don't want to redeem late pass. You just want to practice redeeming late passes. If you wanted to work on the problems late past the due date, and it'll just give you half credit. So you so if you've already got full credit, don't click on that. It's just going to give you half credit for everything you do. It's going to lower your score. You don't want that. You would just click on practice because you say, oh, I just want to go back and practice. And it'll say, oh, you sure? If you do that, you can't do late homework. Okay, yeah, sure. I just want to practice. Click OK. And um, there it is. Took a little bit there. So then you can go back over. So I'm going back over these questions. You know, and I can do it as much as you want here. Da, da, da. Is that the answer? says no okay what's the answer oh, okay okay give me a new one uh get a similar right and you can just practice the old practice exam questions as much as you want use the videos do anything you want it all works fine so that's how you get ready for a retake exam first go back and look over your old exam under past assignments click on the one that's not a rocket the ones that are not rockets to go back over your old exam and then go to the practice exam and go back over that make sure you know all those questions and uh, use the videos when needed. But of course, you got to get to the point where you can do the problem without the videos because that's how the exams are. All right. I hope that helps. And, and I hope you succeed in your testing.